inside. Ryan Fulton was committed, but sporting in front. Pinto. Controlled well. What a challenge by Steven Sarah. Just as Figueredo was about to pull the trigger, Sammer's leg came in from nowhere. Yeah, an excellent challenge, wasn't it? It was a great touch on his chest. And again, the picture seems to hold up, thinking maybe it's a... Jordi Medeiros with the in-swinger for Sporting nice. Lisbon. Oh. 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 Disappointed with the result, um, probably more disappointed with the manner in which we conceded the goals because, you know, you look at two of them being set pieces, which any level you play, you'd like to, you'd like to think you could avoid them. So uh, disappointed on, on how we've conceded the goals, but pleased in as much as I thought J uh, Jordan Ivey looks a really good player in the first half, looks a real threat. I thought their keeper had to pull off two excellent saves in the second half, um, and we knew it was going to be a very, very tough ask with the. Uh, you know, with the, with the makeup of the squad and, and how we were going to be, we, we knew that it was going to be a challenge. But to play in this stadium, in front of a team who are probably one of the favourites to go and win it, I thought was, you know, was was a fantastic experience for everyone. Just a learning experience. Now we enjoyed the tournament, and we just really have to um, improve on that and just take the positive from the tournament that we've done and just improve next year and hopefully we can get further. I think if we take the parts of the goal out, I think the boys did well. We fight. We was thinking about the boys who were injured back home to give everything for them. We couldn't take, we couldn't come, we couldn't win. So we have to just learn out of it. There are days like this in life. It, these things just make us stronger, and we're gonna 
think forward and think next game. So there is no point now to just keep the head down and just cry on it. Oh, tremendous amounts. I think it's a fantastic tournament. I think it's, um, with respect to everything that's, that's domestic, I think if you want the benchmark for, for youth football, then the next gen probably provides that because if you think this year, the level of opposition that we've played and the, the tactical outcomes that you're, you're going to have as a player, it's it's been far away. At, at home, more often than not, you'd have large percentages of the ball. You'd come up against similar shapes each week. So to come here and 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 be taught exactly what you need, I think is a great experience.